Hello YouTube land, I'm Eddie and this is Windy Therapy. This is where I share my passion for motorcycle riding, camping and outdoor adventures. So if you're new in here, please consider subscribing at the end if you like what you see. The button down below, at the end, not now. And if you're not new, welcome back guys. Uh, I'm glad you keep supporting me and I'm glad you keep coming back. So today we're gonna do my second Windy shout out and my therapy moment as I call where I'm gonna be talking a little bit about me my past my background to really allow you guys to get to know me better on today's shout out we're gonna have three mail calls and I have more I'm sorry I'm late I'm trying to catch up with my mail guys but I like to do three maximum because I want to have enough time to talk about each channel and give them the proper time so without further ado let's give her So the first one comes from Randy, from Roddy Riders, from um, Rhode Island, USA. So let's see what Randy sent me. Randy has uh, a new channel. No, he has, let's see, I have to check my iPad. I can't remember everything, guys. My memory is not as good as it used to be. I guess you get the drift of that. So Randy has about 110 subscribers right now and uh if, in, if i'm not mistaken he's rocking a uh, harley davidson let me see if i can get this stuff right a road glide special i don't want to mess it up so randy sent me a couple stickers such like this one and two smaller ones which they look pretty cool okay and Randy sent me a little note saying, Hello, Eddie. Thank you for the sticker trade. Your sticker will be added to my collection. Make sure you write it like you stole it. But be safe. Thank you, Randy. And he said here, Thank you so much for following me and engaging with my posts, which I, I tend to do the best as I can. Uh, but I believe it's important to support each other. Thank you so much, Randy. Uh, I'm gonna be linking all those channels down below so if you guys are not following one of those three channels uh, or all of them please please do you know, a lot of good folks that are gonna be highlighting on today's video thanks Randy I really appreciate you I hope you got my stickers also the second one comes from a guy who's pretty special to me is Spider Wayne Spider Wayne He's a fellow rider, he's Canadian actually, but he lives in New York uh, for quite some time, if I understand correctly. And other than being a, a fellow rider, uh, Wayne and I have a connection because he also has a motorcycle pop-up camper. So we have a lot of things in common. So let's see what Wayne said. Send me a letter here. Hi Eddie, to a fellow motorcycle camper owner, I'm enjoying the informative and entertaining content that you share. Keep up the good work, friend. I really enjoyed the shenanigans that you shared from Brazil. I guess if you haven't seen it, go check it out. Uh, I was in Brazil uh, back in February. So if you haven't seen those videos, I think they were pretty cool. Go check it out. Uh, so that's uh, Wayne's letter. And let's see what he sent me here. He has a Spider Wayne deco, which is very nice, Wayne, really well made. And if I'm not mistaken, you, you designed by yourself. Good job, buddy. Not everybody can do that. I, I, I can't, so I had to get someone to design it for me. Another sticker, like the hologram kind of style. Another one, which I believe he also designed. Great job, Wayne. And he's, uh, he got a business card as well. Uh, like I said, I love this guy. I believe he's the one who has the nicest motovlogger voice out there. I love his voice. I love what he does. And his channel, even though he is, is somewhat new, uh, he managed to learn a lot as far as uh, editing. And uh, let's see if I can find out here very quickly. 
he has 170 subscribers and and his editing skills uh, improved a lot in the last few months and kudos to you Wayne you are doing a, such a great job buddy and he also sent me some uh, wristbands and his wristbands is in memory of his uh, wife uh, Gail that passed away unfortunately in 2013 uh, and if you look his sticker you know, really kind of shows uh, uh, Gail's name from 1957 to 2013 uh, so thanks for the wristbands uh, Wayne and I'm gonna do the same that I'm doing with my uh, Elena wristband uh, this this wristbands are those two gonna be riding with me in my motorcycle all the time so Gail and Elena are gonna be always riding with me buddy okay I appreciate you love you love what you do uh, geez now it's kind of windy here my stuff is flying away I hope it doesn't go too far away thanks so much Wayne and the last one the third one comes from no other than our favorite spider lady and friend purple on three this one I'm gonna take some extra time because uh, I love purple on three her husband PSP Tommy G I was about to say that that's her better half but honestly she's the better half so sorry Tommy you're the sec you're the second best half how about that uh, I really love those two guys not only for what they do and for the kind of videos they're shooting uh, they just retired congratulations again uh, Jody and Tommy uh, but they they make such good videos they're so fun entertaining and something that's very dear and near to my heart is the fact that I believe she was the first one to send me a sticker when I got my chain weapon running so she was my first one not the way you're thinking she was the first one to send me a sticker and, and for that I will be forever grateful other than all of that uh, look what she sent me she sent me of course her stickers she just got a new one made right purple and tree she got a new design going which I really liked but look what she did she sent me a motorcycle rock that says this is a motorcycle rock throw it in the air and if it hits the ground just go ride it so in one side says ride now the other side says ride motorcycle so you can't go wrong so let's try and says ride motorcycle which I'm riding right now and there's more look what she did she painted this rock I hope you guys can see well let's let's get a little bit closer All right look what she did she painted my logo which is a pretty tricky logo to do and she did an awesome awesome job uh, Jody thank you thank you so much uh, I can't thank you enough for uh, you and Tommy being the way you guys are uh, thanks for the connections and the messages I hope one day we can meet in person but uh, that's it thank you guys so I'll be listing all those channels uh, under the description so please follow them if you're not not only on YouTube but also Instagram because they all have Instagram accounts as well so now comes to the final part which I'm calling the therapy moment therapy in a sense that it's not something bad or sad it's just a chance of you guys to uh, get to know me better uh, so this is my my couch today uh, I'm taking a chance to take you guys to different spots every time uh, if you look the background my bike is down there this beautiful lake in the back uh, makes everything even more special so so let's start from the beginning now uh, we we moved to Canada in 1996 uh, my wife and I and our son he was one and a half year old at that time uh, we moved to Canada and um, we quit our jobs sold everything that we had but when you, it's, it's quite amazing because when you exchange the the money from Brazilian currency to US dollars wasn't much no we had about eight thousand dollars US which is not enough when you think about now would you guys move to a different country that you didn't speak the language you didn't know uh, a lot of people you didn't have a job 
uh, is, is a tough one. And so it was hard. And even if you take $8,000 in today's exchange rate and put in some inflation, it's probably $10,000 US today, right? And needless to say that it, that money didn't last too long. Uh, I didn't have a job, like I said. I sent 200, still remember, I sent 200 resumes out from the 200 resumes. I got two uh, job interviews and then I finally got my job, my first job in Canada. But the problem was before I got my job, we ran out of money after three months, right? And uh, that, that third month, we didn't have money to pay rent. We didn't have money to buy food. So it was pretty stressful. And um, so we had to go to the welfare office and ask for information. Can you guys help me? I, in a few more weeks, I won't have money to pay rent. And because I had 300 bucks, they said, listen, we can't help you because you still have money. You have to be at zero, then we can talk, which I thought was kind of crazy. Uh, but nevertheless, uh, that was pretty stressful and sad to a point. Uh, but like I said, thankfully, two weeks later, you know, I got my first job and the rest is history. So I'll keep it that for now. I'll keep telling you a little bit about me and my story. Uh, but for now, that's it, my friends. If you like this video, give me the famous thumbs up. If you didn't like it, give me the thumbs down. That's okay. Uh, if, you, if you don't know the channel, if you liked it, uh, please subscribe in the button down here. Uh, and again, I appreciate you guys. And as always, be good, be safe, and let's keep the rubber side down. Ciao.